Hello everyone and welcome back to module one of Bootstrap. So in this session, we will be learning about Bootstrap cards. So let's begin. First, we will see what is Bootstrap cards. Then we'll see card header and card footer with the help of the Bootstrap classes. Then how we can declare a contextual colors for the cards. Then card title, text and links differentiation. And then how we can implement an image inside a card. So let's start and then some example of it. So first topic is what is bootstrap card? A card is a flexible and extensible content container. It includes option for header, footer, a wide variety of content, contextual background, colors, and powerful display option. So if you observe this image, you will see a card. Basically, a card is a container which implements or which contains contents like header, footer, body, list, and all the content which we use inside a HTML program. So this is the basic structure of card. Now, mostly the cards are used for testimonials. If you want to display some product for your particular page, if you have an e-commerce website, so inside which you will have a different product in which you will have an header, an image of that particular product, some information for that product and some buttons for that product. So all these things can be included inside a one card. So as you can see, your header is there, then image, then whatever body you want to apply inside this. So what body can contain title, subtitle, text, others, and buttons and links, then list of group. If a particular product has a features of list, so that can be also implemented here as well as the card footer. Okay. So this is the basic structure of card. Header and footer. A dot card header class adds a heading to a card and dot card footer class adds a footer to the card. So basically a first particular class of this div or you can say if you want to give a class or if you want to give a card class, then you have to mention simply first card. So dot card will define that your card content has been started. Likewise, which we used to do for div. Now in div we have two card container, oh sorry, Container and container fluid. What does that indicate that this particular div element is now container? So likewise, if you give a class of dot card, then the computer or the HTML code will understand now this particular div is a card container. So simply you have to give card. Now, if you want to give a header to that particular card, so what we have to do, we have to simply use the class name dot card header and then we have to implement or you want to write any particular paragraph, list and buttons, you have to include that particular heading parts inside the card header class. So you will get confused when we are doing the theory part, but when you once see the practical implementation, your all the doubts will get clear there and there. So simply card header, card body, and then card footer. Now contextual colors or contextual card colors. To add a background color, the card use contextual classes like BG primary, BG success, info, warning. So same, we used to give background to the container or we used to give background to the buttons, text. So all this card can be implemented or all this card can be given a background color with the help of again contextual color. So what does contextual colors are? Dot BG primary because we are giving the background color as primary. So contextual color class B primary, success, info, warning, danger, secondary and so on. So all these colors contains the particular contextual color for your card content. Then comes title, text and links. Use dot card title to add title to your particular heading element. And the dot text class is used to remove the bottom margin for a paragraph element if it is a large side or the only inside a button. Okay. Now, what does this mean? Now, use dot card title to add a title to a heading. So, this much is clear. We have to use dot card title to add a title inside the particular card. Now, if you want your particular paragraph or is your paragraph is the only contain inside the body tag then dot card text removes the bottom margin for that particular body so see dot card text class is used to remove bottom margin so whatever you have written here 
they the particular code will remove the bottom margin for your particular paragraph if your paragraph is the only element inside the body or your paragraph is the last child of your body the dot card link class adds a blue color to any link and hover effect so if you want to display any link then what it will add it will add a blue color to your particular link or a particular text and then last topic for the card is card image to place the image at the top or at the bottom inside the card use dot card image top or dot card image bottom so if you want to display any image inside the particular element or inside the particular card you can simply use dot card image top or dot card image bottom if you want to display on top you have to use top if you want to display inside the bottom you have to use bottom simple so let's start the practical implementation now so here simply we have taken a blank file and save that file with dot html extension after that we will write a simple html structure giving title as bootstrap cards next step is to copy the cdn links so let's do that okay after that inside the body section we will simply take element as div giving class as container now inside this div we will take one more div element and now here we will provide class as card that means from now from this particular div a card content has been started so before that we will give an h2 that is heading tag as basic card okay now inside this card element we will mention one more div and we will give class as card dash body so we are providing this particular card body for this and inside which we will write a basic card structure okay save and let's see the output so as you can see this is my basic card structure okay wait one second so this is my basic card structure simply we have declare one div with the help of the container then we have write in a particular heading tag after that we have mentioned one more div giving class as card that means it will make a particular html code understand from this particular point my card container starting after that inside this card element we have given one more div element and we have given class as card body and we have written basic card structure so this is the basic implementation of how we can create a basic card structure okay now once you are done with creating a card so we will require a header and a footer so for now i'll just clear this body part okay simply we have taken a container here we'll change heading to header and footer save header and footer card okay now inside this card we will mention a div giving class as card header simply have to mention card header and here we'll write header part then next would be our div again and here will mention as class body so card body here will write body part card header part and here card body part okay after that a last card contain this footer so class card footer and then here we'll mention as card footer save and reload so as you can see my card header body part and footer part has been displayed so whatever content you want to mention inside your particular header part should come inside the card header section whatever part you want to include in this particular body part should come inside the particular body section and whichever like footers links buttons or redirection parts are there 
you can mention inside the particularly footer class so this was simple example of how we can assign a card header card body and card footer with the different different part of the cards our next topic is title text and links for that again we will require a class with the help of card and then one more class implementing as card body so simply we will particular cut this particular sentence okay so we have simply taken here we'll change the title text and links okay okay then we have taken a div as class card and inside which we have taken another div with the help of class body now inside the body we will take a h4 that is heading tag and we will provide class to that heading as card title so simply we will mention card title we will give card title name for this particular card after that we will mention some text inside the body so simply we will take a paragraph so a uh, basically text is implemented inside the html with the help of paragraph tag so simply we have taken a paragraph tag you can take any tag if you want to take a spam tag or if you want to take any other tag you can implement just you have to give the class for that particular part so here i am giving class as card text why because we want to implement or give particular text inside this particular card so some example and then last is we want to provide a link so simply we will make use of a tag that is anchor tag now for now we will give a hashtag because we do not want to interlink that for any kind of pages and then here we will make use of class as card link save here we will mention link name as card link save and let's see the output so as you can see a heading that is title text and link card has been displayed then inside my card body a card title some example for that particular text and card link has been displayed so this was simple example how we can display a title text and link inside the card if you want to give any particular header and footer here also we have to mention so simply we will write a div we will give class name as card header and here we'll write card header see we load so as you can see my card header has been displayed so this was the simple example how we can implement and give or assign card title how we can assign or give tight particular card text inside the body and if you want to give any reference string for that particular card so simply we can do with the help of this card link tag our next particular part is image card so simply i have taken again we will take one more particular card okay for that again we will just erase this particular part okay so here we have simply taken a container now we will change heading to card image card image after that we will mention a div that is with the class card and then we will give a style to this particular card as style width equal to 400 pixels so we will give a card width after that inside that we will mention an image tag so i am the image source we will give av and what now here i have saved my picture with av what so i have written that particular name if your particular card name or if you want to display your particular image with different name you have to save that particular image into same file in which you have contained or saved the html file so simply i have given the name then we will mention first here class as card image and 
top. I want to display my card or my image to the top. So I have given simply card image top. If you want to particular display a particular card image to the bottom, so you can assign bottom. Then we will give a source and then we will give style and width equal to 100%. Save and let's see the output. So as you can see, my card image has been displayed on top. Now, let's write some more content so that you will understand it better. So I'm giving div class as body, that is card body, inside which we will specify one title, h4, then class, card title, Okay, then we will give one link or first we'll give paragraph class card text some example then last would be a link that is a href we will give hashtag and we will provide link. Or we can just give styling effect for this year. So year will mention class, PTN, PTN primary. So the primary effect would be assigned. And simply a tag close and then we will close the div. Save and reload. So as you can see, my image has been displayed. A card title, some particular example and link. So this is the basic example how you can implement card inside your project. So if you observe neatly, so when you go on the e-commerce website or some kind of website through which we can do sales, so in that website we see the products for the particular links or the products for your convenience. So what you see a particular card inside which we see an image. Then we see the particular description for that particular image or the product and then link for the payment or if you want to get redirect to that page, so that link has been provided. If you want your image to at the bottom, simply we will write your bottom. Save, reload. One second. Here we have to mention image bottom and this particular image tag should be mentioned after the link tag. So simply save and reload. So as you can see, my image has been displayed to the bottom. So I hope you have understood this card particular topic. Thank you.